Good morning, Wolfpack. I'm Wole Ma. And I'm Jonah Mercado. Today is Thursday, October 27th, and we are here with your morning announcements. Please remember that AP commitment forms are due November 1st. Also remember to join the AP classroom on College Board. Please contact Ms. Chase or Ms. Anaya if you have any questions and check, out, check your Synergy email for more information. It's that time of year again for Pumpkin Palooza. This is a contest where students and teachers can pair up with each other to design a pumpkin. The winners will receive a $15 gift card. Pumpkins are due today, so get them in before the fall festival so they can be judged there. There's an extension for senior portraits. The new and final deadline is Monday, November 28th, which means you have about a month to ensure that you're featured in this year's yearbook. See the yearbook website, the Senior, Cla the senior Class Google Classroom, or Ms. Hadagi's newsletter for more information. Community college classes are available through the Advanced Education Program. Current high school students can only take a maximum of two college courses each semester. For more information, please attend the Zoom session tonight or on November 2nd. The Zoom links are available in your student view email. Are you interested in learning, playing, or finding out about the role-playing game Dungeons & Dragons? Please come check out the Dungeons & Dragons Club in HP7. Meetings are Tuesdays at 3.45. Now let's pass it on to Damon and Kylie for In The News. Hey there Wolfpack, I'm Kylie Evangelista. And I'm Damon Ramos, and this is your In The News Update. The U.S. economy grew at 2.6% annual rate from July through September, snapping two straight quarters of economic contradiction and overcoming punishingly high inflation and interest rates. Still, the outlook for the economy has darkened. The Federal Reserve has aggressively raised interest five times this year to fight chronic inflation and is set to do so again next week at in December. The Biden administration has urged the Supreme Court to reject a novel legal theory pushed by Republicans in an upcoming elections case from North Carolina that could strip state courts of their ability to oversee federal election-related disputes. Solicitor General Elizabeth Pelegar wrote in a brief filed late on Wednesday that the case being argued would have extraordinarily disruptive consequences if the court embraces the independent state legislature theory. The court's ruling could have a major impact on the 2024 presidential election. The Miss Universe organization has suspended Miss USA President Crystal Stewart and her company, Miss Brand Corporation, pending an independent investigation into allegation that the 2020 Miss USA pageant was rigged. Following the October 3rd pageant, several Miss USA contestants have taken to social media to question if there was favoritism that led to Miss USA 2020 Robani Gabri Gabrielle win. It all started when a major pageant sponsor posted a video of Gabrielle at a luxury spa owned by the sponsor hours after Gabrielle won. Three Florida men have been charged for stealing millions of dollars worth of meat product across the Midwest. The arrests were made following a months-long investigation by the Lancaster County Sheriff's Office in Nebraska and Homeland Security Investigations. The investigation began June 27th when the Sheriff's Office was notified that several semi-trailers with loads of frozen beef had been stolen in Nebraska, worth an estimated loss of $1 million. Further investigation with federal officials in Omaha revealed 45 additional thefts were made in North Dakota, South Dakota, Minnesota, Wisconsin, and Iowa, totaling $9 million lost in stolen meat. Well, that's all we have for you today, Wolfpack. Now, let's pass it on back to the anchors. Thanks, guys. The Visual and Performing Arts Specialized Program is currently accepting applications for all students. If you're a graduating senior, you must apply no later than the end of Term 2. You must earn at least 40 VAPA credits by the end of senior year in order to complete the program and earn your PIN for graduation. Apply today or check in with one of the Visual and Performing Arts teachers to find out if you're on the list. The deadline for, to purchase Disneyland tickets is November 9th. The tickets are $375 and they can be purchased in the student store or in the office with the school site controller. Just a reminder that tonight is the Fall Festival from 5 p.m. to 8 p.m. in the Quad. ASP is planning for music, games, food, a haunted house, and activities for everyone. Also, costumes can be worn, but face covering masks are not allowed. Also, no fake weapons. I'm William Moa. And I'm Jonah Mercado. And remember, the strength of the pack is the wolf. And the strength of the wolf is the pack. Happy, Happy National, National Black, Black Cat Day, Wolf Pack. pack.